All right, we're going to try and uh, program the CRE 8900 now. And we have the uh, program in software booted up and ready to go on the debt, uh, netbook here. And uh, cable's plugged in to the radio. First thing we want to do is turn the radio on. And then go to uh, Setup, Communication Port, COM4, make sure that's good. And then I've got a program, Read from Radio. And it says, uh, Read data from radio, do you wish to continue? Click OK. And then it'll give you a uh, little completion percentage bar graph thing there. And the radio should say PC on the LCD display. <coughs> Okay, read data completed, and then we can view uh, what the radio came programmed with for export mode, which is the standard, uh, you know, band A, B, C, D, E, F uh, export uh, configuration with band D as the uh, the FCC 4026 405 to, uh, I'm sorry, 2646, wow, 26965 to 27405. All right, we're going to go ahead and open up the file that I created earlier. And I'm just going to go ahead and click no because that's built into the radio anyway. That's my programming there. And then we're going to go to program write to radio and uh, click OK. And uh, here it is. PC. Let's see if it works this time. software still seems kind of fickle. Write data completed, OK. So then I turn off the radio, unplug the computer, I believe, and then turn the radio back on. And we have, let's see here, let's see if it's got what I had programmed in here. Interesting. And I have the alpha channels at the end here. Oh, there's someone on 27195 right there. Alright, let's see if this works. And there is the UK FM. Just for fun. That beep is annoying. Cool. All right, there you have it. CRE 8900. There's all the different cool colors it does. I mean, call it a gimmick if you want, but it still is pretty cool. We'll have more videos of this radio soon.